Mr. Mr. Speaker, I join colleagues um, in congratulating the new majority whip, Senator Matangi, um, for his uh, election as uh, the new whip of uh, Jubilee. And Mr. Speaker, I fully associate myself with the sentiments that other members have made um, with respect to um, political parties. I thank Senator Kangata uh, for the work he has done. Um, Senator Kangata uh, is a very jovial and well-intentioned man. And Mr. Speaker, I think for the short stint he has, he has had, um, he's been able to really, you know, try, try the best that he, he could have done um, in that position of uh, majority. Mr. Speaker, I, I am not uh, more experienced than more. Mr. Speaker, there are members around me who are, I don't know what's happening. Okay. They, they want me to be. <laughs> no, Consult no. in low tones. <laughs> <laughs> this, this. Um, uh, Mr. Speaker, what I was saying is that um, in the short stint that he has served, um, uh, Senator Kangata has tried his best. We may not have agreed in his methods sometimes, but I think uh, he benefited from, you know, being able to speak to every individual whenever we had issues where we didn't agree. And, and because of that, Mr. Speaker, I'd like to encourage Senator Omatangi um, to caucus. Um, what we've seen in the past year and, and further is that what works in this house, because we are a small house, but persuasion, consultation, and respect will always trump kifua. It will always trump, you know, intimidation. Because people here, there are no children in this house. And so, there are caucus rooms. Whenever there's an issue, and Senator Matangi, you remember, I was your chair of a party. You know, bring people together. Party position is never the opinion of an individual. The party position will never be said, uh, uh, Matangi's uh, opinion, or Senator Pogish's opinion, or even the president's opinion. A party position in an established democracy is where you sit as members, discuss an issue. And once the issue has been discussed, then you have political responsibility to stick to what the majority have agreed or what the party has, has agreed on. And I think we would like to encourage because we want to pledge to support the work that you're, that you're going to do. Finally, I think it's, it's almost uh, unfortunately poetic that the same words that <laughs> Senator Kangata used in removing uh, Senator Kihika are the same ones he was trying to use yesterday. Mr. Speaker, I consulted the, the Hansard because he was asking for the charges, he was asking for what was the reason of his removal. Mr. Speaker, if you look at our answer on the 22nd of May, Senator Kangata said that Mr. Speaker, Professor King Kindiki told me he would want a written document from the party. However, to me, that is neither here nor there. When the party was appointing or supporting him for that position, he did not give him a letter. Jubilee party did not frame any reason as to why they gave him that position. It was an issue of confidence. So, Mr. Speaker, you know, as, 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 as you go ahead, and even in your position, Senator Matangi and Pogisio, be careful. You know, what you do will be done to you. And things change. And when you, when, you, when you make any rules or any moves, just assume that your worst enemy is in the position to do the same to you. You know, so, so be, be gracious and be kind. So say, I hope Senator Pogisio... Let's consult in low tones, order senators. I hope, I hope Senator Pogisio has heard, eh? because he's the one who told us about putting water on the head. You know, just be, 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 be very careful, uh, because you might be shaved. We hope not. We, we like your leadership. But, but be gentle and never, ever, in politics, Mr. Speaker, the small politics I've done at my young age, never, ever burn a bridge. Don't burn bridges. You might need to walk back in the path that you've come. Thank you, Mr. Speaker, and congratulations, Senator Matangi. We will support you. Senator Locorio. Uh, thank you.